Hey, Sage25, you should use the Barret 50 Cal instead of the Intervention sometime. I want to know if you can use the Barret 50 Cal and still be really good with that sniper and get lots of kills. Well, the answer to that is yes, and uh, I will prove it to you in this game. I'll prove it to you in the first 10 seconds, actually, in which I get 6 kills. Uh, hello, everyone. My name is Sage25, and I have a game of uh, Ground War Team Deathmatch on this wonderful map that is High Rise. And I'm using the Barrett 50 Cal, as opposed to the Intervention, which is what I um, would usually snipe with. Uh, a couple of people asked me to use the Barrett, uh, and by a couple I literally mean two, but that's alright. I know I'm going to get at least two views on this video, so props to you guys. Um, I, I wasn't a fan of the Barrett too much before I started using it this time around. Uh, I don't know, I was just kind of urged to, to try and get some gameplay with it, so I did, and I, I liked it. I started to like it. Um... Anyway, if you don't know much about me or my channel, uh, my name is Sage25, at least that's what my gamer tag is. I like to uh, record myself playing video games, and then I like to record myself talking about that game. And then I just put those two wonderful things together, and, uh, and the offspring that results is a wonderful commentary for you guys to see on YouTube. So, uh, so here you go. I'm basically going to use basic sniper class, well, basic quick scoping class, if you will, which is the, the Barrett 50 cal with FMJ, and I got my perks as Slide of Hand Pro, and I got Stopping Power and Steady Aim. Um, by the way, I forgot about this, but this is on my uh, second account, so that's why, well, it's called the Ice Age, get it? The Ice, the Ice Age, my name is Sage. It's like a play on words, um, so that is why it shows as the Ice Age when I kill someone, uh, and that's why I don't have Stopping Power Pro or Steady Aim Pro, because I was like a 12 when I got this game or something like that, um, but it's all good because it doesn't really matter when I'm sniping, when I'm quick scoping it, at least. And then, uh, good old stun grenades and throwing knife, which don't really matter in this game. Throwing knife is really fun though. I recommend you use it. I don't care who you are or what you do. Um, at least try it out once in a while. Uh, one of the games I'm going to post in the very near future, it might be my next, is going to be an all knifing game. And uh, I, don't, I don't think I use a throwing knife too much in it, but you'll see a few kills with it. And it's a lot of fun and you can actually get good with it regardless of what you might think. Uh, my kill streaks this game. I had to I had to look over them before I started talking about them because um, I thought they were going to be standard kill streaks, which the first two are. They're uh, a UAV and a Predator, and then I believe my third kill streak is a nuke uh, because, like I said, I'm really low level on this account, and I decided that if I uh, randomly got a 25 kill streak, then you know I wanted to get a nuke out of it and get a nice video out of it. Which is not going to happen this game by any means, but just so you know, uh, UAV Predator Nuke, which is probably not the best idea if you're planning on actually getting a nuke, but that's okay. Uh, otherwise, if you want a nuke, uh, you want to sit in a corner. Well, you don't have to sit in a corner, but you want to, you know, hold a choke point with a silenced assault rifle and probably put on Harrier, Chopper, Gunner, and Nuke. That's your best bet, unless you're C-Nanners and you're the best player ever. Just kidding. Um, that guy's pretty good though, he's cool. That could have been sweet. I could have been montage worthy if I had killed that guy and then the other guy behind him and then the guy next to the guy behind him. Um, I totally would have put it in my montage, it was just one shot away and then two more. But what are you gonna do? Um, Anyway, man, Team Deathmatch goes by a lot quicker than I thought. I haven't actually talked about anything productive this game. But what are you going to do? Let's start now. Alright, this spot on the map is really good for sniping or assault rifles. As you can see by my 
amazing uh, run there I had up at the top with one kill and then getting killed. But actually it is if you use it right and you don't have nine people looking up at you. Uh, then you can uh, pretty much see the entire map, aside from inside the buildings. Painkiller shot in the neck. What are you going to do? You're not going to do anything because he's on medication and there's nothing you can do. So that's all right. Um, that's one of the top five things I hate in this game. And here's uh, another one of the top five, which is, would be a noob tube, which happens a lot in, in Ground War. Uh, it's probably the worst part about Ground War. But anyway, the game's coming to a close, as you'll see in like five seconds, uh, with a pretty sweet ending kill cam. That's some fun stuff. So I end up 27-9 and nine with the Barrett. Not a fantastic score, but uh, at least able to show you some of my skill with the Barrett as opposed to just the intervention. And uh, make sure you guys, of course, rate, comment, subscribe, the usual. And uh, I'll see you guys shortly with another video. Peace.